At what point did you go from just being a paid actor to saying, I'm going to start writing these films. I'm going to start producing these films. I'm going to start directing these films. I'm going to start handling the distribution and everything else like that. Because how many films have you done yourself? About 45 or 50. 50 films yourself. Idea of, of, of any business. You can't be a success in any business if you don't understand the business of the business. Mm. Also have to understand that the longevity of whatever you do has a limited. So you have to be changing and growing all the time because whatever you did two years ago may not work now. So if you don't have the ability to make those decisions yourself, they're going to forget about you because they only remember the, the people last week. They only did whoever did something last week. That's who they remember. If you're not doing something now, they don't remember you. You have to remind them. You know, so I try to put myself in a position that they will never have to say, whatever happened to the hammer? Whatever happened to Fred Williamson? What is he doing now? That so far in my life has not happened because you hear about something that I'm doing all the time. What was the biggest budget film you ever put together yourself? Two and a half million was, uh, and I got and I got screwed royally, man. Mm -hmm. uh, Orion did our film, Original Gangsters. Mm -hmm. Now, my again understanding the business of the business is what I'm is what I'm good at. I raise the money through foreign sales. Foreign sales to me means that Germany, Italy, Sweden, France, one on one. I sell it to you for France. You give me a check. It's all yours. Here's the film. Give me a check. It's over. You don't owe me any more money. I kind of know what my film is going to do in France. Give me the check. You can burn it up if you want to. I don't really hear shit. Next, Germany. Okay, here's my, you give me, you, here's the film. I take the check. Country by country by country. Sell deal, not a distribution deal, because then you're going to lie to me like, <laughs> right. Like nobody came to your movie. I said, well, I walked around and I saw lines around the block. You tell me nobody came to my movie. What are you talking about? Well, we got distribution costs. We got, we had to bring some people oh, in. Yeah. No, I don't yeah, play that game. I'm still game. waiting for my first royalty check for my first See, I don't film. Play that. I don't play 15 that. years later. So that's I not my game. It. I don't play that game. That's, yeah, why my market, that's, why my, that's why my foreign market is so big. It's country by country by country. And I'm there, each one of these countries. I'm in front of them. Here's my new movie. Play it. Show it. Here's what I want. I want, from you, I want 125000 For you, 150000 Mexico, 30000 okay? I know. I, I don't want no pesos. pesos $30,000. And I kind of know what each country does well with my films. That's how I've been able to survive. And that's how I raised the money for some of these films. And I raised that money for the original gangsters and the movie was going to be the biggest so far and Orion filed bankruptcy. Mm. Three weeks into distribution. Wow. It had made almost $40 million. I made it for a million five made a $40 million and they filed bankruptcy and everybody got a dime but me. Stole your money. All of it. All of it. 